Hello, hello everybody, I am Nasty Mould, and today we're going to be looking at this week's upcoming traveling spirit, the Scolding Student. This is one of my favorite spirits. I love their hairstyle, I love the cape they come with, the mask, the only thing they don't have is the neck accessory I'm wearing. This is one of the very, very few green capes in the game that is actually not an in-app purchase. It might be the only green cape that isn't an in-app purchase besides like the default green cape and the tier 2. So in this video we are going to check out where we can find the Scolding Student, check out their cosmetics in greater detail, and check out the estimated pricing for this upcoming spirit. Let's go! This spirit can be found in the hidden forest and it's actually in one of the first areas so we don't have to go too far. All we have to do is pass the first two gates and then we'll find it along the left hand side. Now you may have an issue with the rain here so bring something to recharge yourself if you need it or an umbrella if you have one. So I'm just going to fly through the gate if I can make it. And then over we go, and towards the left hand side along this wall we will find the scolding student. Pretty easy to relive, all we really have to do is follow them around and then up the treehouse as they scold the baffled botanist and it's kind of sad. Alright, now that we have relived the scolding student, let's check out their upgraded emotes. This spirit of course gives the scold emote, which always makes me feel like I've done something bad and like I'm in trouble. Here is the level 1 version. The level 2. Level 3. Oh, they're getting serious now. And level 4. And now for a closer look at this spirit's cosmetics. Something that I love about the assembly spirits is that they all have these black masks. This one has a little triangle on the forehead in gold. They remind me so much of the Season of Rhythm Ultimate Reward. I love it. For their hairstyle, we have one of the very few hairstyles that has a pop of color within it. This one is a double braided hairstyle with some bangs. And you can see there is a little ribbon on top of the head that goes down and intertwines with each braid. This one is very cute. It's a nice touch on like the classic braided hairstyle. A bit more color though, and instead of being behind your head, it is over the shoulders. I don't wear this one as often as I should, but I say that about pretty much every hairstyle I have. It's cute. And now for the cape, which I do love. It's one of the very, very few green capes in Sky. And I think other than the base game green cape, the only cape you can actually get without an in-app purchase that's green. It's got this really nice dark color, the typical star pattern on the back. It has these little dots of green at the ends. And this like almost glowing gold going up. It reminds me very much of some sort of a butterfly cape, although I don't think it's really supposed to look like a butterfly cape. It is so pretty. Maybe like clovery or flowery. Very, very leafy and nice. I love the shape too. It reminds me of those Lightseeker scalloped capes. 
and here it is in flight. Pardon my horrible flying. I had to cut this so many times because I would just fly into trees, so it's a little funny looking. There I am bonking into a wall. The shape is so pretty. Yeah, flying feels pretty normal in this one. I know flying isn't really uh, different depending on the cape, but sometimes the cape feels a bit heavy. This one feels pretty similar to like the base game capes. Whee! Alright, that should be enough. I guess let's also melt the cape so you can see what it looks like melting. Goodbye, cape. Here we are, losing our light. And those gold parts are now turning gray. And a little recharge back. The recharge looks so pretty. Ah, so yellowy, so nice. Now, I suppose it's time for the estimated pricing for this spirit. Please bear in mind that this is all an estimation. It may be slightly different when it comes to the live game, but it's a good way to get like a base price. So at the very bottom of the uh, tree, we have the Skull emote, level one, which is obviously free. The level two one connected is four hearts. Above that, we have a blessing for five candles. And connected to that, we have a heart for three candles and their mask for 24. Above that, we have a permanent wing buff for two ascended candles. Above that, we have another scold emote, level three for three hearts, and a level four version connected for six hearts. We have another blessing above that for five candles, and connected to that, we have their hairstyle and their cape for 50 candles and 70 candles, respectively. So for this spirit, we are looking at an estimated total of about 13 hearts, 157 candles and two ascended candles so pretty expensive but honestly not one of the most expensive spirits i'm pretty excited to see this cape back around i love seeing green i miss green and with that that is everything to do with the scolding student thank you so much as always for watching you guys i hope you found this helpful i hope you enjoyed and i will of course see you in the next video bye bye